Good morning! Happy holidays! For those who celebrate Christmas, happy Christmas! I don't celebrate Christmas because I'm Jewish, so um, I just get the day off relaxing, which is very nice. So, in honor of the holiday spirit season, I got a little glittery today. I don't know if you can tell. I could get a lot more glittery if I wanted to. So, what I did is I thought this would be a fun time to film kind of uh, some of my highlighters. So, let's start with uh, one of my new favorites I told you about on my um, MAC MSF collection video. Uh, this is Max Light Scapade. Creamy, um, subtle highlighter that, um, that works. It's a good during the day one. A really flashy one is the Mary Lou Manizer. I think it's the balm. Yeah, the balm. This is very popular here on YouTube. So I did order it. I ordered it online, uh, I think, through Amazon.com. Um, sometimes you can find it on sale. I didn't find it on sale. It is um, a nice large product, but it is very pigmented, like extremely. I did put some on today, but it's so pigmented that I used a fan brush, which is so, so light because this is very extreme. You have to be, I have to have a very, very, very light touch with it. Otherwise, it just looks awful and, and magnifies my pores and stuff. But if I just use a teeny weeny bit, it's really fine. It's good. Um, the other ones I mentioned are all my um, shiny MAC MSFs. These, um, all the MSFs, they're all beautiful and I use them all the time for highlighting, for going over blush, for highlighting, for added glitter. Those are my favorite, favorite, favorite. Um, some of the ones I have bought, uh, is the Estee Lauder, they have these, uh, pure color shimmering, this is shimmering sands. These are the gel, um, consistencies this one's kind of a bronzy one which is good for the summer this is one I bought this year I'm not all that happy about it it doesn't have much pigment but I guess to be very subtle it's Estee Lauder signature pink shimmer it's got um, in the sunlight when I tried it and I looked outside in the sunlight it was very shimmery so that's why I got it but it's so subtle um, it's kind of a difficult one to get a bang out of. Um, let's see. Uh, so ones that I discovered, I used, I really love glitter, 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 but, um, I discovered the benefits of these subtle kind of highlighters this year. One of them is Max Crew Highlight Powder. This was from one of the Beach Collections. And I hated it at first. I was even going to take it back. But I took it back to the store, but then I took it back home. And I'm glad I did because it's a nice, subtle highlighter that blends. You can blend from your blush to a highlight. Very subtle for the day. Another one that's like that is uh, this MAC Pearl Matte Face Powder in for a treat. This was from one of those collections this year, I think. And it's, again, it's a very, very subtle kind of blending color. Um, some shimmery favorites I, I said before was the Benefit Girl Meets Pearl Liquid Highlighter. This one's amazing. I bought all of the, um, some of the MAC Luster Drops because... They look like they'd be great highlighters, but they're kind of hard to work with, I think. And I really haven't used them, but I did buy two of them over the years. Pink Rebel and Bronze Hero. I, every 
once in a while I might try to play with them. I have a couple samples that are very nice. The NARS Orgasm Illuminator I got as a sample, which is very nice. Uh, Stila All Over Shimmer Illuminator. I don't know if I paid for that on sale or got it as a sample. It's very, very nice. The liquid ones are pretty fun. Uh, here's a NARS Coca Cabana Illuminator that's liquid that was sample. I love um, shimmery bronzers in the summer for that extra glimmer. This one I bought this year is the Lorac Tantalizer, which I never know how to open it. This packaging is the worst in the whole wide world. And every time I try to use it, I cannot remember, oh, there we go, how to open it. You got to, oh, it's terrible packaging. But it's very, very shimmery. So for extra shimmer, it's a fun one. Um, this Lorac 3D Luster, Liquid Luster, I did buy this year, and it is fantastic. It's really fun. It's kind of um, hard to use. You have to be careful. It's very liquidy, but when you get it on wherever you want it, I, li I love it right here. It is amazing. It is so beautiful. I wish I got the gift set of all of them. But it's kind of, I accidentally spilled almost all of it this year, and I'm really bummed about it. It's very tricky because it spills very easy. Um, I have a lot that I really haven't used, um, like the Honey Rose, MAC Honey Rose, this is that cool cooling powder, turns cool, it's very shimmery, I haven't used it, I did go with the hype and on 20% off um, Sephora sale like in April this year, I bought three of the Ambient lighting powders just they create a subtle face powder effect um, I never use them because they're they're very expensive and I save them for special occasions but I haven't really used them all that much at all uh, I also started getting into the NARS multiples this year I haven't used them much at all but they're so beautiful they're amazing NARS is amazing and this is a highlighter one South Beach which I can use during the summer. Um, a highlight that I like to apply is um, Max Crystal Avalanche Eyeshadow, which I use as an extra special highlight here, which I did today. You can also use it cheek on the cheek um, or inner corner, which I did today. It's gorgeous as a highlighter. Uh, I think I told you about Max Cream Color Base in Pearl. I bought it years ago. I thought it was a blush base, but it's not. It's a highlighter for me and if I use it which I haven't used it very much um, it works really nicely the other shimmery shiny happy products um, glitter is always fun if you use glitter glue I love glittery shadows um, the other products that I love are these MAC dazzle lipsticks with glitter in them I bought a bunch when they came out they first came out in a collection I'm wearing one today in red in honor of the holidays um, I love them. I don't wear them very often, but I love them. I think they stay forever. They're very comfortable to wear. And Max Dazzle Glasses, which are amazing. I have a lot of them. I hardly ever wear them, but they are amazing. Like, I have a lot more. They're the most beautiful Mac product. They're one of those extra special, nobody does it like Mac products. The Dazzleites are just gorgeous. They're expensive by the ounce or whatever, but they are beautiful. They're one of the all-time MAC products. Um, I bought this this summer, Buxom, a Buxom Tahiti bronzer as a kind of bronzy highlighter. I, I liked it in the store. At home, I find it very subtle like too subtle but I haven't played with it all that much and I have some all over shimmer powders that I got as samples oh here's an all Stila all over shimmer powder that I bought on sale I really like those um, I thought I think I have a those silver dusk Mac shimmer kind of loose powder is gorgeous so that's an example of some of them that I have. 
and the ones that I, I love that I mentioned. So happy shimmery, glimmery, dazzly holiday. Have a great day. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.